Hey, so we're just on our way back from training with Karahat in uh, Bangkok, on our way back to Pattaya after <laughs> a lot of fights up in Chiang Mai, so this will be our first time back in exactly a week, actually. We left a week ago. Wow. <laughs> it's been a long week. Um, but I did a live feed from the road uh, yesterday on our way down to just to Ang Tong, where we stayed overnight last night because we were making these appointments for today, so I kind of covered a lot of the way up. But uh, so we stayed in Ang Tong last night in order to have some appointments in Bangkok today before heading home. And uh, first we went and talked to Stefan Fox, who's the head of the IFMA. Um, and we meant to just go have like a 10 minute conversation with him talking about the Olympics, but you can't have a 10 minute conversation with Stefan, <laughs> which I find fantastic because actually um, an hour feels short with him. He has so much to say and it's always so interesting. Um, so that was awesome talking with him uh, and kind of um, I listened to this uh, podcast with Joe Rogan last night, well, the Joe Rogan podcast, and he's talking to this guy who was referring to another guy who was talking about, like, how you go into rock time, and he's basically talking about how uh, you look at things in the grander scale, like, the grander scheme of things of how much does this matter in geological time, basically, like, looking at hundreds of years rather than being pissed tomorrow kind of thing. And uh, Stefan is not that broad, but he does think in terms of years, which is really, really interesting. Um, and he's just a genius. Like, the stuff that he gets done uh, is incredible. So after meeting with him, we rushed over to train with uh, Karahat at this uh, gym called Corner Gym uh, that I had seen Diesel Noy at before. But I love training with Kara. <laughs> like it makes me so happy like I almost had the like can't sleep thing last night because I was so excited about it um, and I've been working on a lot of the stuff that he worked with me on in our last session so I was all proud of myself that I was going to show him how like relaxed and fluid and how much I can like make my jab come out and stuff like this and he's like mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you're doing this entire session southpaw <laughs> I was like what I'm not good at that so <laughs> All of the things that I'd worked on were now put into the southpaw stance, um, which is actually really brilliant um, because the, I was telling Kevin, when you're uncomfortable because you're in your opposite stance rather than uncomfortable because you're trying so hard to relax, which is not how you relax, um, it ends up kind of tricking your brain into using the things you've been working on in an actual non-thinking about it way rather than thinking hard about the things that you want to show that you've been working on. So um, I think this is my best session yet with Karahat and he's building on things and because he's cornered for me he actually like watches my fights and thinks about them and is like this will be good for you we'll try this. Um, and I think that it's making really really huge differences in ways that I'm not even seeing yet. Like I think that I'll kind of understand all of these things he's building on a while from now, which is kind of what I got from Master K. It's just things come in a long time after and you're like, oh, that's what he was teaching me. That's what that was. Um, and the session just felt really good. I felt much more free. And uh, Kevin paid me one of the best compliments ever. He said that I looked like Karahat, like I, I was moving like Karahat. So that's exciting because he's my favorite fighter. So looking anything like him makes me very happy. Um, and... Yeah, so that's the that's the update from the road. When will you be fighting? I'm fighting again on the 17th. Today's the 12th. Um, I had a fight actually tomorrow that the opponent isn't there anymore, so I got an unexpected um, cancellation for my fight in Parat. So instead, I'm just going straight to the fight on the 17th in Sriracha, where I will be rematching the star, who I fought twice in Patia, and she has changed weights a few times. <laughs> in those times, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to smash her, so I'm pretty excited about that. Uh, it's Sankran, so happy Thai New Year to everybody. Um, and yeah, I'll talk to you uh, before my fight for sure, and we'll be live streaming, and uh, yeah, that's the update from the road. Alright, take it easy.